Um, today I'm going to tell you what to do when your gerbil is aggravated. I put my girl gerbil with my boy gerbil, but it's completely safe. I had my gloves. I was watching them to make sure no mating was happening because I know that what mating looks like and you have to separate them quickly. And gloves are handy too. But um, she scratched him because he came just a little bit too close. He scratched him on the muzzle part, so on his face basically. So he was bleeding, so I got wet paper towel. I dabbed off some of the blood from his fur, and I put on my special medicine for him, for my pets, all my pets, so he would heal faster. And I take really good care of my pets. So, um, and then I got aggravated at Chica, but I didn't dare hurt her because that would just mean another gerbil that's hurting. So, um, this is what I did. I took my gloves, I put them on. And I just started tossing her a little bit like this. But not too high that it scare her or make her afraid of you or make her want to bite you. Just a little bit. And then you blow on her because gerbils hate to be blown on. And then right before you put her in the cage, you just go like this. So she knows not to do it again. But again... You have to do it lightly. So I'm going to show you how to do it. So this way your gerbil won't hate you forever. And you'll feel like you did something good. So let me go get him. You want to wear gloves because the nails might come and puncture you. But this time I'm not using them. So you just have to go like this. Okay, so just do that a couple times. So blow on her. Fix her hair. And right before you put her in the cage, go. And then she'll know not to do it again. This way you're not hurting her or making enemies. And this way you can take your um, feelings. But you just don't want to hurt her. Don't let your adrenaline or all that blood pumping through you, get to her, don't squeeze her, okay, you just want to do this in a good manner, and let her know it's not wrong, so that was the tip of the week, so say bye bye Chicky, do not hurt Marco, okay, Marco, good girl.